Rob Ford seemed to live his life trying to prove that you can fight City Hall. Can you get off my driveway, please? Can, you tell can you get off my property, please? Yeah. What don't you understand? Get off the property, partner. He was the mayor of Toronto from 2010 to 2014, entrusted to leave one of North America's largest cities. And to his core, he pushed the boundaries of the city's civility and conventionality. He was elected by voters of the so-called Ford Nation. His blunt-talking bombast struck a chord with suburban and working-class taxpayers, fed up with the people Ford called big city elites. But it was the images of Ford smoking crack cocaine in the spring of 2013 that gave him global notoriety. The infamous antics and denials that followed... I do not use crack cocaine, nor am I an addict of crack cocaine. ...created a spectacle that became a running joke all over the world. Yes, I have smoked crack cocaine. But no, do I? Am I an addict? No. Have I tried it? Um, probably in one of my drunken stupors. The denials, the apologies... To the people of this great city, I want to offer a public apology. The circus that had become his life all irresistible fodder for hours of late night comedy. Live from New York, it's Saturday night! Have I ever smoked crack? <laughs> yes, but that was in the past. Hey, don't judge him. <laughs> Maybe he's cleaning up the city by smoking all the crack in it. <laughs> You're next, prostitution rings. <laughs> but to be fair, there's not a lot to do in Toronto. His excuse for smoking crack is he was drunk. Even with the merciless mocking from late night hosts, he almost seemed to relish the ridicule and, of course, the attention. <laughs> have, you, have, you, have you watched that video? Have I watched? I felt yeah. it. <laughs> the drug and alcohol abuse continued. No money, no money, man. Ja. He finally submitted to rehab, all the while running for re-election as mayor in 2014. But it was the sobering diagnosis of cancer that forced him to pause, contemplate, and fight for his life. What followed? Abdominal surgery, chemo, radiation, recovery. He abandoned his campaign for mayor, but continued as a city councillor. Rob Ford remained unapologetic, insisting his personal life, his shock talk, his unconventional approach to politics had nothing to do with his earnest appeal to voters. A man taking his fight for the little guy all the way to City Hall.